Yeah, he I know one, he's close by. He went to one weekly and just kind of, you know, showed up, messed around, went with us to Denny's. Sounds it was about a good right. time. He's, he's, a, he's, a, he's a young guy. Definitely a, a character. For sure. Interpret that how you want. I think it's a pretty good thing. He's, he's an interesting guy. All right, game one going to tower. Ooh. Neutral stage, pretty good for Absinthe. Great stage for Crag, too. Like, this is just an awesome stage for both parties. ZB is definitely one of the more interesting Crags. <laughs> you see a lot of, he's a very fast Crag, a lot of Nair 1 setups, a lot of just, like, heavy APM movement. He's, he's smart, too. Like, I watched him tech the rock at the start of this match and just immediately go on the offensive. Yeah, he also tends to be very, very offensive. A very bizarre contrast from the other crack we'll see on the other side of the Yep. I'll get to that when we get there. <laughs> Funny box. Love to see it. Up yeah, smash has that little flex. Penguin's doing a very good job on keeping his resources, <laughs> but ZB's doing the best if he can to milk it. Ooh, man. That crag weight coming in clutch there. So the record is, uh, you know, a little bit Penguin favored. It's actually did. been pretty close in terms of the game count recently. I think oh, it's okay. been game five at the past two <laughs> tournaments or something. I think it was not Skyline. It was a different tournament. But I know Z the last time they played, ZB took a big game. ZB is really using that rock like a Rano bubble. <laughs> like it was just always there to save the help position. Out. You keep it on the platform, you DI into it, and you tech. Yeah. Really innovate in the position. It is so good in this matchup because if you put Rock on like that top platform, Absa has to up air it. Yeah, like, what do you do? Like Absa has to commit to it and break it. Also, if Crash at the ledge there, it's so hard for you to actually be able to edge guard without just like you know throwing out, um, just like putting Cloud at ledge. Because Zebi can just like jump up and up air. He uh -huh. punches you, pressures you off the ledge. You can do up air, you can do fair. It forces Absa not just like sit there, and you can like put Cloud down there. Maybe you can just like you know, Cloud kick when he comes up. Oh, that kind of puts out this pressure. That you have to for. Yeah, no, I can totally see it. The edge guard's rough. Ooh. Ooh. Very good oh, mix up there. Hit. If Penguin reacts to that, it wouldn't have been easy to be enough to love her. See, he's very good about these cloud fairies. He's the, so far, he's definitely been... <laughs> oh, my God. Gets the rock, gets hit. He's That's definitely fine. been the most Plot on point up, out of fine. all the absences that we've seen on screen today. Like, against all the other absences. He definitely has, like, a lot of experience in this match. Mm. I saw that little, uh, little dash up tilt. That was scary. He's getting a lot of miles out of just like flat drop fares. Just like staying at the top <laughs> yeah, and then is. just landing super fast. His movement is extremely just big. Meteor striking this poor man. Oh, he got it. He's, he's been fishing for a while. He's gotten like 80% of these parries. And not specifically the really long dash back parry. He missed one earlier, but he's been so on top. He's been playing super on point recently. Even though this set count has been really penguin favorites, he's putting himself on the map. I know Penguin's the type of player to like not do so well in game one. <laughs> <laughs> Throws the rock down and just he he used it like a substitute. <laughs> he was gonna get kicked <laughs> by Absa, but nope, boop. And then turned it around and got a stock at. Look at that! Look at that. He, he used it like a substitute. Oh my god, uses that to bait him in and then just nair one fast fall up smash. Super clean. He got a little turnaround. That was really cute, yeah. yeah. I know a lot of Crags love to do like um you can do like jab jab nair one up smash. Called the Jujujukas Jab 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 Cancel Love Smash. <laughs> it's a little different. Has the same intention. Because if you hold out in on Nair 1, you can just eat an up smash or an up air or a fair. Really, really good stuff from Crag. Yeah, that's just ZB popping up at the ledge, showing that you can't just like stand at the ledge. <laughs> Very good source of pressure. Ooh, we're going back in. This time, like three top. top. I, oh my. Not ZB not has not missed any of these clouds. If I'm Penguin, I'm thinking, hmm. My side B button is a, is a go helpless button right now. That's not good. <laughs> it's not working out too well. Penguin used that to put it at Cloud Hike. He loves using Cloud to cover all of his bad landings like yes. that. You have to with that, so. Yeah, it's so good to use it like that. Ooh, no pillar? no pillar, okay, well, but fine. he trades with that side B. <laughs> Penguin was already ready to cover the There's higher monster recovery. trucks right in anyway. He's Man. fine. Big sweeping hitbox. Ooh. Fair. This is usually Penguin's historically bad. a lot more recently. Well, after we get a fair, we usually do like a cloud hop turnaround bear or a cloud hop up bear because it's like a short hop distance instead of that full commitment, which also still saves his double jump. So in case uh, ZB still DIs in and lives, he can just get a regular double jump fair. Got it's just a way to extend his setups and give him a safe landing even if it doesn't work. I get you. Every time I see Penguin at a tournament, he's always innovating something new. It's always really a great thing to do with I've noticed ZB's been really on top of his DI. Like when he's getting hit by the uh, the fair and bear strings off stage, 
he's he's living a lot of them. Oh yeah, his shift has been absolutely impeccable. It's almost like he's played this match a few times. <laughs> This is quite a handful of absence in this region. He's played me, he's played Akashi. It's he's quite a handful Penguin. of Penguins he's fought, yeah. <laughs> oh, great cancel shards are so good in this matchup, whether oh, it's for edge guarding okay. Absa or scary. just for getting off pressure at the ledge. Absa can carry that and then it breaks the it breaks the pillar, which really? then forces him to recover low. I've done that, I did that against MSV when we were playing a while back. If you yeah, he'll break cancel shard down low okay. and then you parry that, it gets rid of this pillar, you can just like hold jab at ledge down tilt and then you just off stage with the pillar. Ooh, yeah. wow. ZB's on top of these. What was that? Right like SCI down on the, uh, yeah. on the Nair and then get a parry out. Yeah, SCI crazy. down, teched, and then parried. Because I know Penguin wants to do like some drag. Maybe like an even a no tech parry there, because that was that was really quick. Penguin has just been holding in on these setups. ZB loves his like little two pieces, like the Nair up oh, airs, yeah, the Bear up <laughs> smash, the Nair up smash. It's always off the top of ZB. Oh, Not big so fan much. of the Rock just sitting behind the pillar here, too. He's big chomp. Yeah, he's got the Crag House set up. He's really usually does. like an extra wall of defense that you have to account for. I know that MSP loves doing that. You in Crag House now. Yep. And Crag House. Did tech off it. Now he's on pulse. It's more like a, a mini Crag House. It's like a... Oh, God. A Crag Condo, you know? Yeah. Ooh. Did did a super good tech on the pillar. The, this is not the cloud great. There. Yeah, he's just dead. There's nothing you can do about that. The pillar is gone. All Penguin has to do is just time when he's going to do his wall jump, and you get a free kick. So even though Penguin hasn't really found as many early stocks, his neutrals just been so good. <laughs> like yeah. he's he is definitely winning exchanges with ZB more often than not, and that's that's really hard in itself. Yeah, you've seen a lot of these near three up there that I was talking about before the set. A lot of ways to just kill off the top. Oh no! Dash back as strong. I'm really appreciating a uh, Penguin. The little cloud hop movement he does because Abs doesn't have a normal double jump. He uses that to wave it on the flats faster and acts as a regular double jump. So it's really enhancing his movement by doing that. You <laughs> that was cute. Jumped up, made ZB sure. Okay, this is either going to be like a down B, maybe a thunder line, a cloud, nothing. <laughs> just some pressure. Yeah, Penguin is not giving him that space. He's just putting cloud knowing that that little threat range around it. <laughs> oh, it's cool. <laughs> It was a really cute little like saying cloud pump F strong. Was just so sure it was gonna work. He had the F strong charging before the cloud like seemingly blew up. ZB is just rolling out of this pressure. It can be really scary. Oh, there's the uh, zip zap down oh, below the stage. Oh, he loves doing it's that. It's so it's, scary, it's, man. It's terrifying because if he gets the very nice from there. But about that last setup there, if. Penguin does that at ledge against a character. You can just zip down and then get a, a, a dare off that immediately off the wall jump. And if they tech it, you can do Rising Cloud behind and bam. So it just covers the tech. It's terrifying. I'll start implementing that and it makes edge guarding so good in these situations. Yeah, no, it is utterly terrifying. I've seen you do it, Penguin do it, and Pro to do it. So it's starting to become there's a thing now. To it. There's, there's a, Penguin starts <laughs> a little and the other there. apps catch on. He paves the way, and we just learn. Every tournament, there's something new to pick up on. Yeah, it's kind of nice. Sometimes you uh, rather not uh, forge your own road. Sometimes yeah. it's cool to it can see be the hard road to already innovate. traveled, you know? Yeah. <laughs> hey, that's the fastest way to get to that innovation, though, right? Build off of the shoulders of giants. That's what everything is. Ooh, Merchant Port, always classic. A big favorite of Arizona. The big AZ stage. <laughs> ZB's basically good. Arizona, right? Yeah, yeah he's basically I he's Arizona. Basically <laughs> Ooh, that was a very good downbeat. He's done a couple of those in the past recently, or just go for like some really, really risky downbeat setup. Ooh, man. I was scared he wasn't gonna land that without a change, to be honest. He's definitely SD with downbeat a couple of noticeable times. He did it at Genesis against Fullstream, he did it against Cake at Skyline. Ooh, that's rough. Like 0% SDs with downbeat because he's just that like, was also I rough. go for it. <laughs> That was rough. He still got a solid lead, though. First stock was taken super fast. Pardon me. And yeah, no, I mean, this has been really close, all things aside, with how kind of fun funky this game has been. Yeah, Zeebe's starting to just carry a lot more on the ground. He's definitely scared, but he realizes that if he gets one carry, it's just... <laughs> Oh, I think that, that was, was supposed to be a wave land down smash. I think it was exactly what that Wave land down smash. He saw the down come out yeah, immediately. Yeah, he oh, dropped that's the plant so there. Sad. There would have absolutely been a kill. Did he get to wave land on? No, he like, kind of like dropped through it, I think. He was on that's the left so side rough. of that plant. He still got a tech there. My man actually teched on the shards as they were leaving. Like, he's <laughs> losing his lead because he's starting to fish a lot. He really wanted that kill. He had like a whole big yeah, percent. He lead. wanted the kill and then forced a ton of extra credit and. 
Yeah, Penguin sees it. Penguin's played this game a little bit, you know? Yeah, he's, oh, wow. he's so kind of experienced. And when you play this game for a while, you can tell when your opponent's getting desperate. Yeah. And go, ooh, in that case, that you so might hard. get this stock, but man, you'll get nothing but this stock at this point, and I'm going to get some damage. That's another thing I ended, up, uh, I ended up hearing about, was that you can do, uh, you can do Cloud <laughs> super low, and it, it covers the pillar, and it just breaks the pillar and forces Cloud to practice a wall jump and tech. Ooh, that's and evil. with that, it forces them to wall, like, recover low. And that, this is a rough spot for the stock. But it is ZB. He is known for having, like, 14 pillars at any given time. Yeah, he will just, like, stall on the stage, go back, and jump off stage, and just pillar again, and just stall there. He's Ooh, done that for, like, like entire that. two minutes seconds before. <laughs> that was, uh, dangerously close to another fan. Great SDI, oh, great DI from Penguin. Yeah, there's the break cancer shards. So Penguin's going high, so you might as well just get a lot of chip damage out of that. Yeah. It's super useful. And Penguin's getting to that percent now where he has to be really cautious. And that rock is in a beautiful spot. And CB, you CB's monster! Waiting for Penguin to, Oh my god, Penguin is Absolute, really risky option. like insane person. God, that Waveland! <laughs> he got the tech ledge dash. It's one of the newest things I've been implementing for oh. players. I've seen that with Durai. I've seen that with Tech Waveland. Durai is ZB's really good it. about it. He'll uh, he'll do the um the needle storm. Yep, needle yeah, storm that ledge. Yeah, and the debate. If Look you at hit this. Him, it's like oh, you tech hit me. Ledge dash, no, 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 I hit down you. Down smash. Super Gosh, efficient. That's so good. All right, so we're going ZB's into up on the set. If he wins this, it'll be the first time he's gotten a set win on Penguin offline in recent memory. Unless the Menace list is lying. <laughs> menace, menace is never, is never wrong. Come He's on. Never wrong. <laughs> menace knows everything. Yeah, these techs have been impeccable from these. These recoveries are amazing. Like he's, it, I will say MSB is still King Clown when it comes to the circus act that he can perform off stage and recover. But ZB is just so technically impressive here. Like his tech wavelands are super good. His tech responses are really good, and he's just playing it very smart. It he's, might not be the craziest thing you've ever seen, but it's very clean. He's absolutely taking a page from MSB's book. I think it's also interesting because MSB is doing the same. He's been moving a little bit faster, trying to be a little more high APM with like falling and tech stuff. So I think they're just learning from each other. It's so important to have another uh, main of your character that you can learn from and take things yeah, that are different. Even if to be clear on that, too, you don't even have to be, like, near the same level. One of you can be significantly better than the other, and it's still incredibly helpful. Yeah. Just seeing the game from a different pair of eyes, a different perspective, can make all the difference. And trust me, ZD and MSB have very different perspectives. Yeah, they are, like, absolute opposites. Julie, too. Julie's very different, too. Yeah. A little close to the ZD, definitely but... definitely on the ZD lens, but, but still like, her, definitely her unique. own, Craig. Yeah, he is just not missing any of these carries. <laughs> oh God, the position they're actually Another helping one. ZD out. Oh, I'd love to see it. Oh, that Funny could have been box. enough there. Love that was so clean. ZB has a huge lead in the set right now. Absolutely playing out of his mind. Downswell was really cute there. Gets a lot of extra damage. And <laughs> hey, we're finding that stock, but not before ZB puts him in a really precarious spot. Penguin's pressure with these cloud hops is like a reset option is incredibly useful. Because it can just bait out parries, it can just beat you when you're waiting. It's so good to just catch people <laughs> off the reset. And, Pe and ZB's getting these Hail Mary up smashes. Penguin's falling into all of them. Cool, that was very close to beginning the even game. <laughs> Every single kill from ZB has been off the top. He's been having so much success with just securing these kills. Going for the zip zap. He still hasn't killed yet, yeah. ZB's definitely experienced with that by now. He's not falling for any of this. Up That's there, yeah. There was really nothing cool. you could do. If he held out, we got a fair Yeah. Time. That was a, a really cool thing he's doing when he's recovering. He is burning pretty much every resource for pillar, which is not too crazy, but that includes wall jump. I I don't think I actually see that many crags be willing to wall jump before pillar. It's scary. Oh, yeah. You're exactly burning right. every resource. I've done that a couple times to, like, fake going to the wall, because going outside Absolutely. is usually a deep risk, unless you're, like, really far off down there. But if, like, it's good to fake it out every so often, even though pulling to the wall is always the best resource. Yes. But, hey, I mean, if you're consistent and they know how to punish it, it's going to be a lot harder for you. If you pull out some wacky, zany, wild thing even once, you might get a free recovery. Ooh, okay. It's super close game four right now. Oh, that rock pull. <laughs> Mr. Poppers, always there at ledge. Poppler. I still remember that tour. I think it was from Heatwave 3 that was coined. Just like 
Dual Popper. It's so good to just harass with. Now Penguin has gotten like 40% off of the chip. Just from harassing ZB at the ledge. <laughs> ZB made a new color at basically the same height. I love it. <clears throat> just, just to say he still has another, you know? Yeah, he's just chilling at the ledge. He loves to do that. It's just like... <laughs> Down from the rocks is actually pretty good. Yeah, it's in the opposite direction. It's pretty useful. If they try to like, outrange you, they get hit by the rocks. If they try to jump over, they might just get hit by the moon. Yeah. Penguin did down tilt to mix up the timing a little bit, and ZB parried it. Didn't get too much because it sends like back directly down. So it worked out. Very Man, nice that was So there. clean. <laughs> Good timing too, because you have to time it with the um with the end of the curl. Yeah, it was super risky to just try and kick him out of it, but that cloud pop made it so that he'd be in hit stun in order to confirm the setup. I definitely expected a back air or a forward air, but the up air there works completely fine. Game five set. Oh man. Like I mentioned, ZB's like started to do really well against Penguin recently. So if he could win this and finally get his first dub on the board in terms of the offline against Penguin. That would be amazing to see. But uh, you know, Penguin's not gonna really let him do that too easily. Penguin's gonna yeah. be fighting uh, tooth and nail here. He's got just the to make sure. Composure of a, a, a he's got the composure of a guy who's uh, been in top twos of uh, a yep, lot of other tournaments. If oh, no. you, oh, if you apparently, <laughs> I think, near three or four on that, I'm actually not 100% sure. But you can actually do it so that you can just wobble them to about 130. <laughs> I know the SCI, I think, starts to expand a little bit later on. I'm not sure if they change that. But you can literally just, like, fast fall in the air again up fast out of the I mean, at the very least, Obliterate oh, crack. At the very least, that is a full stock's worth of damage. Yeah, even covered. if it doesn't kill, like, he's still on the board. Super huge advantage. Penguin only has 6% on him, but he's probably going to take out ZB stock very soon. So a lot of patience, chucking out the cloud, waiting for ZB to get back, just trying to tack on as much percent as he gets, so that every straight hit like that would just send him so far off stage. And there's no pillar! Looks so like that Penguin has a gigantic lead going into game 5. Man, what an earned lead to at that! <laughs> yeah, Penguin just wanted to prove that he is the reason why he is the top seed here. <laughs> Uh-oh, there might be some lag issues on the side. Oh, wait, did the controller disconnect? Yeah, I can see his port. Ooh. I wonder if he's using old, uh... Yeah, I mean, I, I, I think I see the respect there. Is like, it the, uh... It's, does he use an Xbox One S, or...? Um, I'm not sure. I just know he has a blue Xbox One controller. Mm. I don't know if it's the newer model, but the... I think it's the USB-C one. I once had, uh, the newer model, uh, start doing that a lot mid-set, and it would start, like, making me run off the stage, or just hold crouch. So I really hope for your sake, Penguin, that you don't have the same issue because uh, it got so bad to the point where I could only play like one or two stocks a game max before it would happen to me. So uh, fingers crossed that is not the case for hands, but that was very familiar with game. Okay. Hopefully it doesn't tilt uh, Penguin too much and Penguin still plays at his peak and gets back into the He's floor. He's got good I've got faith in him. Too. <laughs> Remember when the untackable ceilings were a thing? Oh my god, the little cloud pop bear. Untackable ceilings. That, I think Penguin might have died from that so back when there was untackable ceiling. Yeah, I would agree. Those used to be so annoying to deal with. Oh man. Penguin is just destroying. Pressure. Really good little tech chase Bieber, there. Bieber, not going out without a fight. He's gonna at least take a stock. And maybe only oh, a stock. Jeez. That's okay, ZB was looking to rob him with an up air there again. I mean, ZB can do it too. It's not like an air character, but a couple up airs on this stage, especially. Super thin top blast zones. Oh. Yeah, make sure you get rid of the pillar is super important, because then it forces the to have to move. ZB just kind of wants to just chill down there for like 20 seconds and not. Oh, yeah, ZB is 100% okay with just sitting on his pillar the entire match. Yeah, let's keep his refresh his pillar. Now he can just harass with up air and chill off stage. And then he'll just go back up there, refresh the pillar, and go back down. And now he's, he's just chilling. Yep. Very, very... I like how he got the parry. It's waved right around. Had some, you know, a little bit of tech just to kind of stay warm. And then he'll go for the punish. Need a little bit of time on that. It's dependent on how far away Abs is. So maybe he can just have a little light room. And that should be it. Oh, well, maybe I can edge cancel. That's, that's rough. That's a really Very, rough very good showing from ZB. Taking Penguin to game five yet again. But <laughs> Penguin maintaining his now 10-0 record against ZB. <laughs> Going into winner's finals, very strong today. Solid 100. That's how it and is. 10 -0. Can you edge cancel Crag side B once you parry? Oh, um, I think if you're actually in the stun from like, a, you know, when you're in parry stun, like you can do it with like Crag down B when you like edge cancel off yeah, the Yeah, can do it with side B though. Um, I think 
maybe if you go into like hit. I doubt you'd probably have to be like. No, nah, I don't think so. Okay. Now that I think about it. Because I was just I got an idea there. Like I wonder if that's the uh, if that was the strat. Because I saw him going to the lit and then turn around last frame. So like maybe. Ooh, Cake Assault MSB. You were talking about the other pack and how different they are. Well, we're going to see.